Hey there, welcome back guys. In this video, we're going to be going over a USB-C cable. That's right, the folks at Magtain were kind enough to send their latest USB-C cable that also comes in other USB formats. So if you don't have USB-C, if you have USB, or if you have the other versions, that is there. Um, because basically, this is what I have right now, uh, which is what I use for soldering. Right, It goes on and on and on, and sometimes it gets tangled, right? It just keeps going and going. And then it's, you know, you could be like the magician, right? At, the, at one of the shows and just keep going and going, you know, keep going and going and going. And the USB cord. And then when you want to wind it up, you just keep doing that. And then you just pray it stays. And sometimes it does, but most of the time it doesn't. You're left with that. But um, without any further ado, let's get started. Let's check out their version of the mat. I've never had a magnetic um, cable before, so it looks pretty cool. Anything's got to be better than this. Uh, but, you know, this is what I got right now, so let's see what they sent. Uh, pretty cool. Can't say it's nice packaging because it hasn't been opened yet, but oh, it is nice packaging. Kind of reminds me of the um, HDMI cord that I had gotten. Um, magnetic charging data cable. Mini size, portable, magnetic self-winding, uh, neat and tidy. Uh, still sealed. Remember, we always do the first, um, uh, what do we call it? Unscripted unboxing experience. So you see what I see, and um, I have no expectations. You know, and we, you know, what we see is what we get, and hopefully it's good. If it's not, um, you'll know, but most likely it is because you, you can't go wrong with a cord like this. Um, so we're just gonna slice it up. This one's sealed too. Sealed and sealed. They sealed the deal. I got two. Interesting. Might have maybe I'll do one giveaway, right? Um, but yeah, we'll do a giveaway in this video. Cut the cord. Just comment cut the cord and we'll send you guys one of these. I will definitely keep one. Um, but as you can see, I don't need a lot. I have so many. Oh wow, this is pretty cool. Um, comes already twined. We'll just move this out of the way. Let's see, I'm just going to put that back. Um, I guess I might as well leave this one on the packaging. Is it the same? Uh, this one says 60 watts. This one says black, gray, black, one meter in length. Um, yeah, I guess it's the same. Yeah, USB, -C oh, no, um, C lightning. Interesting. Oh, lightning is... And the iPhone. Um, so I don't know, we'll see. On yeah, it is. Hmm. I don't have um anything. Uh, maybe one of the phones in the car. Uh, let me think. Yeah. So we'll do the giveaway for this one. So the giveaway is going to be for this one. It comes with the lightning cable and USB C. Okay. Will definitely work well in a car if you have, we'll test it out in the car and see how it works because you would definitely. Um, benefit from that. So this one's going to go back in the box. Okay. And um, that's it for this. We'll just put this here. Take this one out. Uh, what else is there? A little comes with a little salt package. Don't eat it. It's a activated carbon deodorizer. Do not eat again. So when you get that, so just comment, cut the cord, and you'll be eligible for that one. Um, and let's see. Oh, wow. Look, I thought it was like stuck together, but I mean, it is stuck together, but and it's like magnetically bound. This is pretty cool. I've never seen one like this before. Um, it's about, well, how long is it? About a foot, a meter. Yeah. Alexa, how far is one meter to inches? One meter is about three feet, four inches. So three feet, four inches, three feet's pretty good. Um, actually these are about three feet too. So if you have a setup like this, as you can see, down there works really well. So, you know, you could use it for a connection like that. Uh, you could use it for your car. Oh, but let's see how it winds up. Let's see if I do like this and do like that and do like that and do like that. Oh, nice. And look, it's magnetically bound. This is pretty cool. I like that because um, you don't have to worry about And look, if it comes undone, you just, it just automatically sticks together. This I definitely like. I wish it was longer because, um, if it was longer, I would definitely use it um, for soldering. I would, def you know, replace it with this, but 
as you can see, I can't, so I'm going to be stuck with um, doing this with this, but I would definitely, um, I don't know if you're like me inside the car, um, it, I'm always winding these things up. Uh, but look at that, look at how it winds up, and it probably winds up even smaller. Let's see how small it can go. Let's see if we can get it that length, right? Because let's say we want to, if you want to put it in your bag or in your purse, you don't want to have a really long cord. Yeah, look at that. Kind of neat. I def oh wow, this is nice. Yeah, I don't know any cord that can do that magically. Um, yeah, definitely take it with you in the car, in your in your in your pocket even. I'm gonna let's see if we can go smaller. And see on that. Let's say because you know, especially for in women love stuff smaller. They get a lot of stuff in the bag. It's like the Chronicles of Narnia, in my wife's purse, where it's like the witch, the wardrobe, and I forget what the rest goes. Okay, so it doesn't. I guess the. Let's see if we can go. How, how small can you go? So that's about it. All right. So it's still good. Let's see. No, it's still good. Okay, two fingers. Let's see, two fingers, yeah. Definitely worth it though. And I, I wouldn't do two fingers because, um, oh yeah, it's still, look at that. Probably three, three would be ideal. So let's see if we can do three. Remember, remember we're thinking about traveling with this thing, keeping one in your bag for your DJI stuff. Um, let's see if we can wind it up. Yeah, look at that. Just like three, three is ideal. The three finger length. So this is really good. Hold on, let's see. Because there's, remember, there's a cap to its um, ability to wind. So that's about it. Right about there. Just definitely pack it up with your stuff as you're traveling. And if you have another drone, sometimes you might have to connect to your goggles. Let's see if we can connect. Let's see if power can run through it. Where's my drone? Because sometimes. That's something that you have to do. Yeah, pretty for you. It's definitely long, long enough. So let's say you're traveling, you got your drone in your bag with your DJI Ibotta, and then this will go in here. Whoops, like this. And the other one will go into your phone. Let's see if we can. Just gonna get. Oh yeah, look at that. This one will go over here like that, see that? And then we'll turn the goggles on and see if we can see anything. Okay. Looks good. Uh, oh, but we didn't hear that dung, right? So I need to hear the dung sound. I, think, uh, I believe this is, um, let's see lightning. I just wanna see something. Yeah, hey look, it's a magnetic charging data cable, which is great. So high speed data can go through and probably high speed charging too. So. That's um, they're like, wow, this is really thick. I don't know if it's a high speed data cable too. And apparently it is. Okay, so we're just gonna go here. We're gonna go into, um, oops, there's that beep. You have to make sure you hit that in time. So let's see if it will work its magic, as you know. Ah, there we go. So we'll open up DJI, DJI Fly. And so likely, we'll probably have to turn the drone on if we go to uh, connection guy, but we should see what's in the goggles, camera view. But we can't see what's in the goggles unless we have the drone on, if that makes any sense. So now we're gonna turn on the drone. Let's see. Let that do that. Put this here. Definitely a nice cable. And look, even though it's magnetically wound, right? Um, it doesn't coil up, it doesn't like retract to the sense of like, oh, I wanna, I wanna go back home, I need to retract. Uh, so let's see, hold on one second. DJI Avada 2, mm, bummer. So I just have to resync this, hold on a second. 
because it says connecting to DJI about it too. That's fine. That's an easy fix. Um, because we want it to do is DJI Avada 1. Just switch it. And then you should hear the beep beep as long as the battery doesn't die in time. And as you can see, did you hear that? That was really weird. Yeah. Welcome back to Everything That Glitches. That was really freaky. It's like it's alive. All right. I think I just heard what needed to be heard. Great. And then I'll just take this off like this. Now, if we go here into the camera view, connection guide. Again, we have to do this again. A pretty solid connection. And this is a DJI issue. Uh, as you can tell, it's a new cord. Shouldn't be any problems. And we're going to hear that boom. This part that drives me crazy. And I believe, oh, there we go. Okay. See, now we have our connection guide, as you can see there. And if we go to camera view, it's okay. I'm not going to sync anything with it. Yeah. Look at that. Smooth transition data cable. Look, one, two, three. One, two, three. No delay. I believe the frame rate is different on here. <laughs> but yeah, so far, so good. Look at that. Well, you can't see what's in my goggles, but you can see what's in here inside of the screen. Uh, hopefully, yep, there you go. See that? So the data cable works, the charging feature most likely works. As, as you can see, it's taking the energy from um, the uh, from here, right? Or somewhere, vice versa, and charging the uh, phone. The phone is being charged probably from here, right? Because we have the symbol of being charged. So not bad. I like it. I definitely like it. Um, I'm definitely going to use one of them. I'm going to do a giveaway for the other one because I don't have uh, lightning. Uh, but if you have a use for the lightning cable, please um, leave in the comments, cut the cord or whatever comments you feel necessary. Uh, this way I know who wants to be part of the contest too. If you, you say cut the cord, I know that you're eligible because we have another contest going on. Apparently the fellow has not claimed their prize. Um, so, you know, knowing that moving forward. So comments are great, but if it's at the comments, like, so we know to put you in the entry. And um, we'll just do the giveaway, right? If there's only one comment that says, hey, cut the cord. Um, but, you know, we'll see to each their own. I'm just going to leave that like that. Um, and that's it. Kind of neat. So, if, you know, if you're tired of, um, I'll just do a little magic show, of doing this, like having on and on and on and on, right, with your cord, Um I would go, definitely go magnetic. Too bad this one doesn't, because when you wind it up, it gets really taut a bit, and um, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't hold. Unless you have that little thing, and I don't, even, I don't even know where it is. In the beginning, it was it was cool. I, I'd say, well, I'll just keep it, but now I just wind it up like that. And with this, you just simply, I like it. I just wish it were longer, to be honest with you. But I am definitely going to keep this one in my bag for the Abada. Um, probably the Avada too, because sometimes you're like, oh no, I need to um, connect to my phone again, because sometimes you just have to. Anyone that has the Avada knows that sometimes you um, have to reconnect to connect, and um, you know, it just doesn't work out that way as, as it seemed. And then now this will be in there. And I have another one, another USB C. See, like this. See, it has its little thing to wrap around, but I don't need to in there. I just need one. And, most, and I have one in the other bag too. So, you know, you only just die in another one. Like how many <laughs> USB-C cords do you need? Right. And that's why we will have the giveaway for that one. Um, and this one is, I believe, um, this one, I believe goes to the um, computer, the Apple computer. And that's it. Anyway, I hope this video helped you in better deciding which USB-C cable to get. Um, and most likely this one, there'll be a link in the description down below. It's the magnetic charging data cable. Okay. By Magtane. Uh, great, great product. Uh, does what it needs to do and keeps everything tidy. Um, because it's a self magnetic, magnetic winding cable. Anyway, if you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down below or ideas for other videos. Remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you all next time.